In this practical example we will create the balcony of an apartment, which is an extension of the property that receives abundant sunlight and is usually used for rest. To get started, open the available file. See that we have a polyline that will serve as the basis for creating a small wall. In the Home tab, Modeling panel we trigger Poly Solid. For the height we type 40 and confirm by typing Enter. For width we type 10 and confirm by typing Enter. At the command line, we click on the object option and finish by clicking on the polyline. See the result with the realistic preview style enabled. In the sequence, we make current the aluminum layer and we will model a square column on top of the wall. We pull box, we create a box of 4x4x80 four by four by cm, and we position it on the axis of the wall. We repeat the command box and randomly create a box with 2 by 114.5 by 60 cm, which will represent the amounts of the glass frame to be modeled. We position the displaced box 10 cm relative to the top of the square column, with the move command and precision tools. Next, we will create a parallel copy of the contour edges of one of the faces to limit the amounts. In the Solid tab, Solid Editing panel, we trigger Offset Edge and click on one of the faces of the box. At the command line, we type D for the Distance option and confirm by typing Enter. Then we type 2 and press Enter. Click on the face again and press enter to exit the command. See, we've created a polyline parallel to the outer contour of the face of the box we're modeling. In the Home tab, Modeling panel, we trigger Press Pull. We click on the face of the box and direct the subtraction. To conclude, we click once again with the left mouse button, ending the operation. You see, we have the picture that represents the sums completed. Now let's model the glass with the polyline that we created with the command offset edge, then we fire extrude we type L for the option last and hit enter. For extrusion height we type 1 and confirm by pressing enter. The box we just created is out of position and in the wrong layer, so keep track of the correction. OK, we've got the glass in the right position and layer. With the command 3D mirror we will mirror the column and later the set formed by columns, uprights and glass to the other side of the balcony.
See, we have part of our balcony completed. Let's create a handrail at the top of the columns. We have enabled the conceptual visualization style and the midpoint and center of face precision tools. We trigger polyline and create a polyline for further extrusion. We set off poly solid. For the height we type 1 and confirm by typing enter. For width we type 5 and confirm by typing enter. In the command line we click on object, and we finish by clicking on the polyline. Look at the result, we have the handrail modeled. We invite you to model the amounts in glass for the front of our balcony using the techniques presented here. We finished this example, where we modeled a balcony in AutoCAD 2017.